and welcome to Letty Does Literally Just Popping Cooking Donuts. So guys, as I have realized from doing one poppin' cooking, which was the waffle one, um, these take a little longer than I initially anticipated to make. Maybe it's because I'm doing it wrong or I'm just way too into this, but um, yeah, each of the popping cookings that I have are going to be their own individual video now. So, next up I have the popping cooking donuts. So, I got this for $3.50 at a local Japanese dollar store called Daiso. Um, it is a... Well, it's advertised as a DIY candy for kids. Um, you make your own little donuts. I think they're really cool looking. Um, apparently, I'm not very good at <laughs> designing things, but um, I, I, do, I am having fun making these, so I do want to make this one. Anyway, so I'll be making it, letting you guys see the process and letting you know if it's any good or if I feel misery, miserably. So, let's get started. All right guys, so here I have the poppin' cooking box. There are the donuts that you can make. Um, let's see, these are like the instructions and stuff. And it says here on the top that it comes with a tray. I don't know why my autofocusing isn't agreeing with me, but it comes with a tray, a spoon, a squeezing bag, and some sprinkles, and then I guess all these colors. So yeah, let's open this baby up and see what's inside. Alright guys, so I have the box here. I have my water over here. I'm gonna probably regret that, but that's a later issue. So, let's open this up. Oh wait, does this one have a... So this one has like a little tear thingy, but I don't know why. Eh. I don't really see the point of opening like that now that I know how this goes. I'd rather have the full area to work with. Okie dokie. So, this is the packaging on the inside. I think it's kind of cute where it just has like the stripes and stuff on it. Um, this is what I'm supposed to put all my stuff on. Oh, it tells me to cut it here. This little pink thing is supposed to be the thing I display the donuts on. Fuck that up! Alright. There we go. Let's see what we have. So we have the little tray. I'm gonna try to keep this in tight. There we go. And then we have all these packets. And then what I guess is going to be our like piping thing later. Oh! This one's little spoon is different. It's more of like a like a shovel. The other one was definitely more spoony. Okay. What do I need to cut off this? I wonder if I can just snap this off. It looks possible because it has like a indent. Oh, shit. <laughs> I broke it. <laughs> Well, it's 
it's okay. We'll work around that. Anyway. I got it! Yay! Now my now my little like butt cake looking design is missing a part. Which is sad because that was the one I was so excited to use too. I wanted like flower bunk cake donuts. But of course, this is why I can't have nice things. <laughs> so I guess I don't need any of this. All right, almost done. Oh fuck, I broke this one too. Ah, Letty, what are you doing? All right, let's do this. What do I need to do first? Step one, I need to Fill the round depression with the musical note with water. How much water? Oh, oh, it means the, okay. Uh, yeah, I did that, all right. Okay, and then I need to add powder from yellow packet. This is the part where I'm looking at this and in my head I'm just thinking, this isn't enough water. I need to add more water. <laughs> But I'm not gonna do that. <clears throat> that little voice in my head is wrong. Dang, I have no idea if this is the right amount of water for this. It's not all gone. Oh my gosh, this is so much effort! This cannot be the correct amount of water. And it says for me to knead them into balls, which I don't know if I can do that. Because <laughs> these aren't very, what's the word, Ma malleable right now? They're not agreeing with me. This is like after I had added more water too and it's still not growing. I'm just gonna stick one of these in the mold right away because it's not sticking to itself anymore. This can't be the right amount of water. I had to have fucked this up already. Okay, so here I have one little donut. I think that looks cute. I like that. And then as for this one, I don't know. I'll, I'll just, I'll like get a little more water on it because I, I don't think, I don't think it's supposed to be this hard to manipulate. <laughs> I'll try to stick this in the flower mold, but it's, it's really just not agreeing with me. Oh, not bad. Pretty cute. Okay, now it says I need to repeat the same thing using this cocoa dough powder, so let's do that again. But you know what, why don't I just try, since my thing is broken, I'll just do a straight in this bag. That would be better, I think. It's just insufferable. Just gotta do a little left and right here, switch between my hands and then try to like push it down. I don't know. Didn't really work how I wanted it to, but oh well. Anyway, I uh, gotta break this in half, which I think is about here. Okay. And then I'll make a little hole kind of in the middle. And I need to push it down into this mold. Okay, so here's my little donut here. I like how cute these are. And, I mean, I like the idea of these. And the thing that really sells me that these are for kids is that this is so much effort for just the result of candy <laughs> that you make yourself. And, you know, I, I'm completely fine with putting in that effort, but it's also like, damn, this is a lot of work. All right, let's see how that came out. Look at it! It's like a little bunt cake. Hold on. Ta-da! That's pretty cute. All right. So with that, there are my four um, donuts. And I think we can get rid of this. So let's set these aside. Okay. Moving on. Now, it tells me I need to add the strawberry sauce powder in 
here. It says I need to add this blue packet, that's the vanilla sauce powder, into here. And it says I need to add this chocolate sauce powder into this big one right here. Ooh. This is less sauce and this is more becoming royal icing the longer I fucking need this stuff. Oh, this strawberry smells pretty good. Ha! Now I know how they make... What is it called? Bublin? I, I don't know what it's called in English, sorry. Never mind. Bloody's making unrelatable references again. Alright. There's the... There's the vanilla and the strawberry. Mmm. There's still a lot of powder on this spoon. Mmm. It doesn't taste bad, but damn, that's a concentrated dose. Alright, and then here is the chocolate one, which looks pretty good. Okay. Now then, let's get to decorating. So for decorating, it says that it wants me to put the chocolate packet into here so that I can use it as a fucking... What's that thing called? You know, so that I can decorate with it. I don't really want to do that. I'd rather have it with the, like, white one or something. I think the chocolate one might be a little waterier than these, though. Hmm. I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, um, to decorate, I have these sprinkles. I have this thing labeled crumbs, which I guess I'll find out what it is. And, yeah, I have a piping bag. That's what it's called. A piping bag. And, of course, my spoon. So I think first I want to decorate uh, this one, and for this one, I don't know, I want to do, wow, this is thick as fuck, I'm thinking, hold on, ah, wrong one, ah, what have I done, ah, ah, oh no, <laughs> I need to stop eating all my ingredients. I think I'm a little hungry in real life. Alright. Baggy number two. I'm just doing whatever the fuck I want. It's a live and learn type of thing, I guess. I'm going to make some little dollops. And then I'll try to soothe that shit out, because that looks awful. Alright. Well, I tried on that one. Alright, that looks cool. And, um, what else? Oh yeah, I gotta use up the rest of this chocolate one, so let's see. I guess this one can have, like, another, like, ring. Of course, I just needed to ruin that one, and then I'm good. Then I'll make this one a chocolate monstrosity. Okay, amazing, and those are my donuts. Now then, let's see what crumbs are. This is just labeled crumbs. Mm. Ooh. Okay. Let's put the crumbs on this one. Ooh, that actually looks pretty dang good. And how about the crumbs on like the little alternating parts of this one? Hmm. Not bad looking, not bad. I'll fill the center with crumbs. Yeah. This one needs more crumbs, I think. Alright. So that's the, all the crumbs I got. Let's see the, uh... Let's see the sprinkles I have. So, these were my final creations, and... I guess they seem pretty convincing. Because some idiot doesn't know that these are just candy. Um, I think this one down here probably... Stop it, Bubba! I like the better without the... No! Go away! It's my candy time! I looks better without the sprinkles, but oh well, it's done. I'm pretty happy with how they came out. I think it looks pretty cute. But, um, you know... Gotta try them. Bubba, this is candy. You don't want it. You can't even have it. It's chocolate, too. I'm sorry. 
I am sorry. I deceived you. Not actual donuts. Oh. He's all butt hurt now. Aww. Wanna be butt hurt? Wanna be butt hurt? Oh, that's sad. Alright. Um, I guess first up I should try this one. Because it has the sprinkles and it's made of the uh, vanilla dough. <laughs> Thinking it's a donut is like really weird. But they look legit! It's really weird, guys. They don't taste bad. But. Damn. I'm very proud of how this one came out. I think this looks legitimately appetizing. So. I'm gonna try that one. But it's so soft and squishy. Oh, and I, I wanna know what the crumbs taste like. No, no. Popping cooking is definitely something that you're like doing for the visuals, and I feel like with these, it's just so fucking true. <laughs> Cause those look legit! You can get them to look incredibly legit. They look like mini donuts. But in the end of the day, they're gummies. And it's the weirdest fucking thing ever. Already, the concept of chocolate gummies for me is really weird. It's like, it makes me think of Tootsie Rolls, and I'm, I'm not a big fan of Tootsie Rolls, but I just put icing on it and like coated it with fucking crumbs and you know, like other shit? <laughs> it's like decorating a Tootsie Roll. A very, very cute Tootsie Roll. But I, these are not Tootsie Roll textures. I just mean thinking of chocolate gummy. That's the only thing I can think of off the top of my head. Anyway. Wow. I don't know. It's fun to do. I honestly don't think kids would mind, you know, having these, regardless of the texture or not. Like, they don't taste bad. For me, they just taste wrong. <laughs> this is the wrong texture. It makes me feel like they're undercooked. And I'm not supposed to be eating them. <laughs> but at the same time, they do taste good. Anyway. I don't know. I'm really glad that I got them to look somewhat decent. I do like the little display paper that they give you. I think that's cute. Um, and I like that you can do everything like without needing any outside materials other than water. So yeah, give this one a thumbs up as well. and. I've had a fun time making them, but goddamn, these are weird fucking gummies. Anyway, let me know what you guys thought of this video of popping, cooking, and donut gummies. And that's basically all I got for you for now, so get out there, do all this stuff, and I'll see you next time. Bye! Hey everyone, Letty here. Just trying on another outfit for my spring of secondhand shops try on haul, March 2020. And if you want to see me wear this striped floral outfit, then you can go ahead and vote for it by checking out that video down there. Bye!